So guys, back in today with another reaction to Sket Dance, this time with episode 68. Um, looking forward to today's episode, we've got no idea what to expect to get. I don't think there was a preview, um, it hasn't been previews for a while now, so um, should be uh, an interesting one after following up this uh, Subaki. Um, kind of focused that episode, last episode, where he had some uh, some t-shirts and designs. Really, again, enjoyed seeing him with Bossoon. I uh, always love seeing those two together, but um, again, hopefully uh, we'll get a little bit more out of those two maybe today. Uh, let me know what you guys think about this episode though down in the comment section. Leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy this one and subscribe to the channel if you do want to keep up to date with these uh, reactions and let's get right into it. These guys gone to the movies out there. We do see a uh, shot of these two in the opening don't they? Don't we? Which is pretty wholesome. Ah, they took his kids. Going on here, having <laughs> some kind of moment. I do not understand. Oh, this should be a cute episode then if it's focused on these guys. Do, do. do like uh do like that teacher. Although again she is a little bit of a a, a klutz. She's very nice, isn't she? Still no sign of these guys, which is so interesting. How late are they gonna leave these guys to be seen? We've only got nine episodes left, I believe. Eight episodes, maybe. There they are. Should have known that there's going to be an episode, considering they're in the open. And a lot of the stuff in the opening does get, or is adapted from the actual what happens in the story, isn't it? So I guess we can expect some Gundams as well. <laughs> I think we've already seen a few Gundams, to be fair. <clears throat> and I really love the full version of uh, of this song as well. I'm hoping. I think we have. I think I've actually seen that we're going to get a, maybe not a special opening, but a special ending for the final episode. So I'm looking forward to seeing that. And I think you'd be right. That's a good sign. Interesting that she's come here <laughs> to get help as a teacher. Not that she shouldn't. I think she should be so uh, upfront about it. I think it's quite a dangerous thing to get in with this guy. <laughs> A love potion? Yes, it's the dangerous. <laughs> mm. 
This almost looks like a fucking a COVID test. <laughs> Who wants to fall in love like this? Very scientific way of seeing things, isn't it? Why have we got to? Why have we skipped the part of talking about the logistics and the uh, the ethics of this? <laughs> we go straight to how do we get him to do it? I mean, I guess it's a little bit of revenge to be honest, considering the amount of times he's drugged everyone else in this series. What are we concentrating about here? <laughs> How to get him to do this naturally? The goggles. The Japanese goggles. I used to watch a lot of Digimon, so I know a lot about the goggles. You've got to have a pair of goggles on your main character. Not sure why that was like a uh, trope, to be honest with you. Not sure many people. Uh, I've never seen any Japanese person wear goggles actually. Not not once. <laughs> I uh, I probably should wear goggles when I play football because my vision isn't that great. I usually go off colours and sounds and such. Obviously, I can't see. Not like I'm blind, but probably should wear goggles. But always just a little bit scared of if I go and someone hits me, they just kind of push into my head. It might crack, who knows, all sorts could go wrong. That and the amount of pressure they'd put on you. I used to hate wearing swimming goggles, let alone goggles out of war. And that's where we get it. You allowed to say that? Nowadays you get cancelled, I think. And spazzed out.
Quite the response. The big day. Well, uh, anything and everything. <laughs> I'm guessing she's the one that wrote this one. Kind of seems like she writes them all. Oh, that's a shame. Um, her daughter, his daughter here is really doing a hell of a lot, isn't she? Hey, nice. That's a bit dangerous though, isn't it? Having a bone stuck in your throat, that could easily pierce through. <laughs> it was just too good. He's having a horrible meal here, isn't he? Of course. Drug A. That did happen a while ago. <laughs> The water did. You know what? Sometimes water is that good. I love the water when I when I finish doing a football or anything. It's like the nicest drink you can ever think of.
This has gone surprisingly well. <laughs> this has gone surprisingly well. No, he's definitely going to want it. <laughs> you should know yourself best of anyone, so it should be a definite yes. And here it is. Is she going to do it? I reckon she won't do it. Do you know I don't want her to do it, to be honest. Although, again, it is some of his own medicine. I don't think it's any way to actually get someone to love you, is it? And it's too late. Oh well, we tried. What a question to be asked by your daughter. So he didn't even do it. <laughs> Again, the outcome I did want to be fair. Yeah, for sure. I don't think a bunch of school kids would be able to help you too much in this endeavour. Stay out of this skit. Interesting.
You propose? No, oh, yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Wow. No ring. <laughs> Jesus. Wow, I was not expecting a fucking proposal this episode. Jesus. Wow, she never knew. <laughs> she did not realize this was a proposal. Come on, Boston. She gonna say no? Why? Why? Yeah, I guess that's true. Well, they have been kind of dating. I guess. I guess you'd call it dating. Yeah, she seemed a lot younger and he seemed quite a bit older. Well, again, that didn't that didn't go exactly where I was expecting it to. <laughs> not at all. I was not expecting us to actually uh, propose right there, but looking good between Tuma and uh, um, uh, what was her name? Not Remy, was it? Something similar to that, though. But the old uh, the old TV lady. <laughs> That's what we call her. Yeah, it was actually quite overwhelmingly wholesome at the end there, wasn't it? Thinking back to the Bossoon stuff as well. Uh, again, it's, not, it's interesting that they show both Saya and uh, Ime in that situation. It'd be interesting to see which one he might have been thinking about. It, he kind of worded it like he wasn't thinking about either at the moment. Again, it just kind of see how things goes. But yeah, I kind of think they're just being coy with that for the sake of being coy, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, quite a uh, quite an awesome episode today, wasn't it? So it's quite crazy. This isn't a special ending, to be honest with you. It has that kind of feel to it, doesn't it? No preview, I'm guessing. Oh, we do. What are all these disgusting shots of it inside? <laughs> Why well, we got first first <laughs> POV perspectives of the poo? Not something I want to see. <laughs> That's something I wouldn't want to see in a horror movie, let alone a uh, let alone a Japanese TV show. Um, yeah, thank, thank you guys for watching. Um, again, a uh, really good episode today. A uh, lot of wholesome stuff happening, a lot of really hilarious stuff happening for about 15 minutes. And then, um, again, having a whole kind of switch up to some really wholesome stuff at the end there um, and some uh, really cute stuff between uh, Chu, uh, Chu Sensei. And uh, and the uh, and the woman again. I forget her name. Is it Remy? It might be Remy. She might be another Remy. Um, I know. I th yeah, I think it is, isn't it? Um, I think that is a name. I I kind of get that confused with the girl, the love girl that we saw in the kind of halfway portion of today's episode because I think her name is quite similar. But um, yeah, it was uh, nice seeing those two um, again, especially kind of co confess their feelings at the end, and then Bossoon kind of talk about his as well. Um, it should uh, should be hopefully leading to, to some very awesome stuff later on. Uh, that's why I'm kind of sad. I think we don't get to see more of this uh, of sh this show and um, it following the manga because I would have been really interested to see where it kind of goes. Um, when it has more than these kind of eight episodes left because it can't really go too far right now as i said it's only got about eight or nine episodes left i um, would have really been interested to see where it goes in the manga so i probably will pick that up after i uh, after i do finish uh, watching uh, watching this on the channel but um yeah really good episode today looking forward to the next episode as well again it kind of seems like a pretty simple one with a with a poo uh, being the uh, the main character it seems um but it looks like we've got more subaki and boss in action so can't wait for that uh, let me know guys think about this one there down in the comment section leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy this one 
and subscribe to the channel if you do want to keep up to date with these reactions uh, as i said i'll be back on uh thursday with episode 70 i think it is now or is it 69 69 the special episode 69 so yeah hopefully you join me then and enjoy the rest of your day guys